Hello children, welcome to my channel. Today we will see class 7 practice set 36 question number 3. Here the questions are to solve equations in one variable. So we will see how to do this. First question is 4x plus 1 upon 2 is equal to 9 upon 2. Equation in one variable means you have to find the value for x. What is the variable in the question? Only x is there. So we have to find the value for x. Understanding children? So in this we will be using the opposites of the numbers. I will tell you how. Now here you can see fraction numbers are there. So here is equal to z. So plus 1 upon 2 we will take to this side. So it will become minus 1 upon 2. Understanding children? So we will write here 4x is equal to 9 upon 2 and we have taken this minus 1 upon 2 to the, to the right hand side. Understanding children? Now we will write 4x. Denominators are same so we can subtract directly. 9 minus 1 will give you the value as 8 and what is the denominator in this? 2. Understanding children? Now we need to check some combinations are there in the question. Yes. We will cut 2 fours are will give you the value as 8. Understanding children? Now what is been left 4x is equal to 4 now again we need to find only the value for x now what is there extra with x it is 4 it is in the form of multiplication so what is the opposite of multiplication it is division so we will take this 4 to the division part means it will become 4 upon 4 understanding children what is left in this side x so what is the value for x you are getting 4 and 4 gets cancelled. 4 ones are 4. So the value for x is 1. Understanding children? This was the first question. We will see the second question. 10 is equal to 2y plus 5. Now here we need to find the value for y. Understanding children? Now we with y 2 is there so we need not do anything but here number is there plus 5 so we will take it to the this side so it will become 10 minus 5 plus 5 will become minus 5 and what is left in this side 2y understanding children now what is 10 minus 5 is 5 and here it is 2y now what is left we need to find the value for only y so we will take 2 it is in multiplication form so we will take to this side it will become division so it will give you the value as 5 upon 2 so this is the value for y that is 5 upon 2 simple to understand we will see the third question 5m minus 4 is equal to 1 here also first we need to uh, solve for the numbers so minus 4 is there we will take it to this side it will become plus 4 so what is left in this side 5m here 1 is there and plus 4 understanding children 5m is equal to 1 plus 4 will give you the value as 5 now we need to find only the value for m so this 5 is there extra it is it is in the form of multiplication we will take it to this side so it will become 5 upon 5 understanding so what is the value for m you are getting 1 that means 5 ones are 5 simple to understand i hope you are understanding the concept children if you find my video like the video and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my channels because i'll be uploading for each and every concept we'll see the fourth question 6x minus 1 is equal to 3x plus 8 we'll see how to do this we will put variables together and the numbers together so what is the variable in this 6x and 3x is there it is in the form of plus so it will come this side it will become minus 3x understanding children and here 8 is there plus 8 okay we'll write plus 8 minus 1 is there it will come this side it will become plus 1 understanding children now we will solve this 6x minus 3x will give you the value as 3x plus 8 plus 1 will give you the answer as 9 understanding you need to find only the value for x it is in the form of multiplication it will come to this side it will become division so numerator you need to write up that means the number you have to write up 9 and 3 will come down understanding children so what is the value for x you will get 3 3 is a 9 so x value is 3 
Understanding children's, we'll see the fifth question. So the fifth question is 2x minus 4 is equal to 4x plus 2. Now we'll see how to do this. Here bracket is there and 2 is written outside. So we will take multiply this 2 here for both the numbers. So it will give you the value as 2x minus 2 fours are. 2 need to be done for both the numbers. So 2 fours are will give you the value as 8. Understanding children's? And here is 4x plus 2. We will write the variables together and the numbers together. So here it is 2x and this mind 4x will come this side. It will become minus 4x. Understanding children? Same way for plus 2 and minus 8 will come this side. It will become plus 8. Understanding children? Now 2 minus 4. Smaller number subtraction the greater number. Answer will be in minus. Greater number is 4. So it has a sign as minus. It will become minus 2x. And plus 2 plus 8 will give you the value as 10. Now again here we need to find the value for only x. So it will become 10 upon minus 2. I hope you are understanding children. So x will give you the value as 2 phiza. But your minus is there. Don't forget to write the minus sign also minus 5. Fine children. We will see the last question in this exercise question number six first question is 5 x plus 1 is equal to 74 here also we need to open the bracket this will become 5 x plus 5 ones are 5 here it is 74 now we need to write the numbers together so we will write 5 x and this plus 5 will come this side it will become minus 5 74 minus 5 so 5x will give you the answer as 74 minus 5 is 69. So again the last step here it is in multiplication form it will come this side. So it will become 69 upon 5. It doesn't have any proper multiplication so the value will be 69 upon 5. Fine this way we have done equations in one variable. Thanks for watching my video. Thank you students.